This is Pima Community College, Culinary 150, Garmage. This is week one, lab two, and your assignment for the week, Caesar salad. Caesar salad was invented by Caesar Cardene in Tijuana, Mexico on July 4th weekend of 1924. The story goes he had some late night diners that came in and he was almost out of food, went back into the kitchen and concocted a salad using only ingredients that he already had. And this is our world famous Caesar salad today. Now, what I've done is, remember when we, in our last lab, when we cut the romaine, we cut it along the spines of the leaves, and then we cut it into edible pieces. That is what we have right here. It's already uh, washed and dried. Now the reason why we dry our dress, our salad, is water and oil repel each other. So in order for the dressing to stick to the salad, we're going to use dry leaves. Gonna set this aside for a moment while we make our dressing. So, we have our glass bowl, our egg. What we're going to do is separate the yolk from the egg like we did last time by cracking the egg open into our fingers, letting the white slip through, holding the yolk, going back and forth with the yolk a couple times to assure that there's no uh, egg white still attached to the yolk. We're going to place that in our bowl Now we're going to start adding some of our ingredients. We have one half teaspoon chopped garlic, two ounces of grated Parmesan. We're going to use our balsamic vinegar. We're going to add some of the red wine vinegar, but not all. And now we're going to whip our egg. Now we're incorporating air into the egg yolk, and this will cause it to turn a little bit bright yellow. That's what we're looking for. Now we can start adding our oil. So while we're still while we're still whipping the egg yolk and the dry and the dry ingredients, we're going to slowly start adding the oil, just like we did the other day when we made mayonnaise. Just a small little drip, small little stream to start while we continuously whip the eggs. The oil I have is six ounces of vegetable oil and six ounces of olive oil. Slowly going to be whipping this into our egg yolk. Takes a little while. If we have any oil floating on top of the egg mixture, we stop pouring and keep whipping. You can see now that our vinaigrette is starting to thicken up a little bit, the result of an emulsion. Remember, an emulsion is the protein found in egg yolk. It separates the oil and the vinegar, and keeps them se separated and floating separate from each other. We're going to continue adding our oil slowly. Dressing starting to thicken up a little bit now. We can add a little bit more oil. If you see oil floating on the top, stop pouring and keep mixing. We can do a little bit stronger stream now because our emulsion is starting to form. All the time, keep mixing. Almost done with all of our oil.
Now we'll add the rest of our ingredients. I have the ground mustard, the Dijon mustard, and instead of anchovy, I used anchovy paste. Now if you have a Cuisinart or a food processor at home, just add in the whole filet is what I asked for on your uh, food box list. If you don't have a food processor or want to do it old school, you can do it this way. So we're going to mix in our mustards, anchovies, Now we have a little bit of red wine vinegar left, so we're going to add this in, just a couple drops. May not need the whole amount. Our dressing is done now. We'll give it a taste. See if we need to add anything. I think the only thing we're going to have to add is a little salt and pepper. mix this in. We'll get another spoon and taste it. Much better. We're done with the dressing. So now just need to make the salad. So I'll take the dressing and now scrape it into a separate bowl for holding. We'll take our lettuce, pour it in. We'll take a little bit of dressing at a time. Because remember, it's always easier to add dressing than it is to take out. So we'll hand toss these. Pour it into our lettuce bowl. We'll garnish a little bit of grated cheese. And there we have it. There's our Caesar salad. Follow the recipe, watch the video. I, uh, excuse me if I put my arm in the way and you couldn't see it all, but this is the way that it's made. And this is a Caesar salad. Happy cooking.